Kermit told me he loves it because everything is green. I'm Darren, and this is three things you need to know for Friday, December the 22nd. With credit card interest so high and many defaults, some are opting for buy now, pay later. Credit card lending has topped one trillion, and debt counseling is way up from last year. Combine this with auto loan delinquencies and student loan payments, and 2024 may be rough. BNPL is the acronym for these lenders like Affirm. I'm going to call it buy now, pain later. Has electric scooter company Bird taken its last flight as it files for bankruptcy? They have entered into a first and second lien agreement with lenders to try to aid their financial position. Taters, a big orange tabby cat, did a video and it was streamed back to earth from a long, long away. The video was sent from almost 19 million miles away, which is roughly the distance to the moon times 80. Trade while you sleeping across time zones with Arbitrage Trade Assist. Sign up today at arbitragetrade.com. Arbitrage Trade is your trusted source for business, finance, and tech info. Why was the basketball court all wet? Because the players kept dribbling on it. <laughs> the dad joke. Corny, groan-worthy, but also one of the simplest ways to share a moment with your kids. What did the buffalo say when he dropped his son off for school? Bye, son. <laughs> so take a moment to make your kid laugh, because dad jokes rule. Make your kid laugh today. Go to fatherhood.gov. Brought to you by the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services and the Ad Council. World New Year's Traditions Across the globe, cultures usher in the new year with a vibrant tapestry of traditions, each reflecting their unique beliefs and hopes. In Spain, merry chaos takes over as midnight strikes. Under the glittering fireworks, revelers devour 12 grapes, one for each month of the upcoming year, wishing for good fortune with every juicy bite. The echoes of laughter and popping courts weave through the air, carrying the shared desire for a prosperous chapter ahead. Another wave of excitement washes over Denmark, where gravity takes a playful back seat. As the clock chimes, families leap from chairs, aiming to leap into the new year with joy and optimism. This joyful act of defiance against earthly bounds symbolizes a willingness to embrace the unknown with open arms. From rooftops to living rooms, the collective jump releases a burst of shared energy, propelling them into the fresh possibilities of the new year. Meanwhile, in Scotland, tradition takes a more introspective turn with first footing. The first person to cross the threshold of a home after midnight is believed to set the tone for the year. Traditionally, a dark-haired man bearing gifts like coal, bread, and salt, which are symbols of warmth, sustenance, and good luck, was considered the most auspicious visitor. Today, friends and family play this role, carrying the hope for happiness and prosperity into each other's homes as the clock strikes 12. New year, new earnings. Go to arbitragetrade.com and check out Arbitrage Trade Assist, which lets you stop watching and start living using Pips, our AI bot. Hey, hon, what you doing with your phone? Taking pictures? No, I'm asking questions. Like what? Hey, Bobo, do flowers have best friends? I'm sorry, I'm afraid I don't know that. Hey, follow me. I want to show you something. Look, flowers do have best friends. Whoa. Some answers can only be found in nature. Discover the unsearchable. Visit discovertheforest.org to find a trail near you. Brought to you by the United States Forest Service and the Ad Council. It's Friday, so it's time for Pick of the Day, Fall Down Friday. Arbitrage algorithms have detected a possible downtrend for F5 networks. That's ticker FFIV. They specialize in multi-cloud application services and are headquartered in Seattle, Washington. It closed Thursday at $178.09, 52-week high of $180.36, and a 52-week low of $127.05. We are not financial advisors, and please do your own research. Arbitrage Trade Analytics LLC is a privately held research company. Arbitrage Trade Analytics LLC is solely responsible for the preparation and distribution of the contents of this podcast. The opinions offered in this podcast are for informational purposes only and are not intended to function as investment advice. Seek a duly licensed professional for investment advice. For more information about the informational research and services offered by Arbitrage Trade Analytics, LLC, please visit arbitragetrade.com.